What is going on, everybody? Hopefully, everybody's ready for this restock in four minutes. Lightweight M4. <laughs> That'd be that'd be nice, right? Uh, thank you very much, Scott. Appreciate it, man. Two minutes. Yeah, hopefully they don't stick that, man. I mean, Reclaimer will still be good, but I don't think it'll be like, I don't think it'll be as good. One minute. Uno minuto. One minute. Huh. Yeah, Andre. I feel you, man. And it's 8 o'clock. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another vendor restock video. Today is October 13th. 2017 uh, I'll start in the open world and then I will go into the dark zone so let's get right into it special blueprint vendor we have a super 90 and a converted USC you kidding me right wasn't this like last week's uh, stamina knee pads stamina mask a rate of fire mag an optimal range scope, uh, stamina mod, performance gear mod, and that's it. Wow, this is uh, this is good. We're good. A uh, special equipment vendor. We have a pecan, self-preserved, talented pecan, centurion with expert and adept, Cassidy with swift, ferocious, and boomstick. Uh, we have a historian with proficient, adept, and history repeats. Liberator with sustained, meticulous, and vicious. 
M45, expert meticulous. We have a converted USC with adept unforgiving and ambusher. We have an ACR with skilled unforgiving and focused M870, sustained accurate and talented. SVD with adept trained and disciplined. RPK, accurate, destructive, and sustained. Enduring mask. Uh, we have a um, firecrest mask. Not too bad if you need a firecrest mask. We have a D3 mask. Uh, if you need one, you can pick this one up. Not too shabby here. 979 armor. Uh, we have a, a vigorous chest piece with all resistance, skill, haste, and ammo capacity. Uh, the electronics is very low, but if you don't have a vigorous chest piece, this will do it for you. Um, it, it has decent armor. Um, we have a sentry call, uh, sentry call chest piece. Uh, 1857 armor, 1236 firearms, health, any armor damage, and ammo capacity. We have a Nomad chest piece. We have a Deadeye chest piece. We have a Banshee chest piece. All the armor is low, so I would not even bother. We have a Relentless backpack. We have a Tactician's backpack. Armor is nice on here. If you need a Tactician's backpack, you can pick this one up, but, uh, yeah. Everyone has an engine bike. Uh, we have prosperous knee pads. We have final measure knee pads. We have hunter's faith knee pads. We have sturdy holster. We have savage gloves. Striker gloves. Lone star gloves. Predator mark gloves. And reclaimer gloves. And alpha bridge gloves. We have firearms mod with skill power and a performance mod, uh, four percent ballistic shield damage. Gonna write that down. Um, special equipment vendor, four percent. Shield damage mod. Uh, bah, 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 bah. We have a heavy mag with crit chance, crit damage, and rate of fire. We have a suppressor with accuracy, stability, headshot damage. And we have a grip with optimal range, crit damage, and accuracy. And then we have a 15 times scope headshot, crit chance, and crit damage. Uh, I didn't do the purple mods yet. We're just working in the base of operations right now. But Delhart, I will be checking the purple mods. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to the stream. Uh, if you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the chat, and I will answer them. Advanced weapon vendor. We have a magnum with expert and sustained. We have a, a vector with brutal, ferocious, and fierce. We have a lightweight M4, deadly, adept, and intense. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm writing that sucker down. Advanced weapon vendor. Lightweight M4. Deadly and adept. I love it. What's going on, big country? Uh, no, yeah, this is, uh, so far, this is the best thing seen. Lightweight M4, deadly, adept, intense, roll off intense, or leave it if you're going to use it for a skill build. Uh, sorry, guys, I was reading chat. Uh, Super 90, talented, self-preserved, and adept. Scar, brutal, deadly, fierce. L86, deadly, talented, brutal. Uh, we have a high-velocity mag, crit chance, and real speed. And we have a suppressor with headshot, crit chance, and stability. Um, we have a grip, optimal range, accuracy, real speed, and a four-time scope. Accuracy, stability, and optimal range. Uh, blueprints are trash. 
Blueprints are a converted USC and a Super 90. I think. Yeah, it was Super 90. Uh, Dark Zone Gear Vendor. Military M870. Response and Meticulous Talented. Uh, we have Accomplished Knee Pads. We have a Performance Mob with Sports Station Range. And we have a Suppressor with Accuracy, Crit Damage, and Optimal Range. Uh, what's going on, Flo? How are you? Welcome to the stream. So far, Lightweight M4 and the Advanced Weapon Vendor. Uh, deadly and Adept on it. Base of Operations Weapon Vendor. We have an FAL, Skilled, Focused, Swift. And we have a Mag with Reload Speed, Crit Chance, and Rate of Fire. In the Gear Vendor, we have a Steadfast Holster. And we have a Performance Mob with Sports Station Duration. No good perps. Honey. God damn it. Data scan. Uh, no support station healing speed yet. Support station healing speed. That's what you're looking out for. I will keep an eye out for you. Uh, flow. Lightweight Ed 4 and the Advanced Weapon Vendor. That's about it. Uh, Camp Hudson Weapon Vendor. We have an AK-74, Meticulous, Predatory, and Ferocious. And then we have a uh, Suppressor with Stability, Crit Chance, and Accuracy. Uh, Eric Howell, you didn't miss much. Just a Lightweight M4 and the Advanced Weapon Vendor. Deadly and Adept on it. That's about it. Uh, nothing else was worth noting. Uh, we have a rehabilitated mask in the Camp Hudson gear vendor. And then we have a uh, performance mod, sticky bomb damage. Damage to elite mod, yep. I kind of guess that. Meat Locker. Meat Locker Weapon Vendor. First Wave M1A, Fierce, Brutal, Capable. And then we have a Compensator, Stability, Headshot, and Crit Damage. How's everybody doing tonight? Hopefully everybody's doing well. Welcome everybody to the stream. Hope you enjoy it. Give me one quick second. For some reason, Nightbot has been really temperamental this week. It never wants to do anything. Okay, hopefully Nightbot decides to show up. If not, oh, there we go, Nightbot, welcome, finally. Uh, Kerman Station, weapon vendor. We have an MP5 ST with commanding, fierce, and brutal. And we have, uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. we have a muzzle break with stability, headshot, and accuracy. Purple mods, no purple mods uh, yet. Flow, I'm assuming you're looking for damage to elites. No damage to elite mods yet. I will let you know if there are any. Uh, uh, what place is this again? Uh, this is Cavern. Cavern gear vendor. We have a rapid chest piece. And we have a performance mod with pulse crit hit damage. And that is all. G36 this week. Andre is looking for a G36. We got Delhart and Flo looking for damage to elites. We got a little ass for uh, support station healing speed. Dante's Run Gear Vendor. We have a <coughs> specialized backpack. And we have a turret damage mod. 
That's pretty good. Uh, where are we at again? Dante's run. percent turret damage and then we have yeah nothing else yes little ass kicker I'm looking for that uh, Tiki there is a good lightweight M4 uh, lightweight M4 in uh, advanced weapon vendor that's about it that's really the only thing noteworthy wolves den weapon vendor m249 cunning or commanding competent ferocious my bad then we have a grip that is accuracy optimal range and reload speed stuck at work don't forget, everybody, uh, that I'm also streaming on Twitch. So if you guys have a Twitch, definitely, definitely go check me out on Twitch as well. Some pretty cool stuff on there. There you go. And uh, Nightbot just said it. Make sure that you hit the gear symbol and change your quality to 1080-60 so you get the clearest picture possible. I'm always streaming in the highest definition. Damien, welcome to the stream, and thank you for the sub. Greatly appreciate it, man. Why won't this tell me where I am? Autumn's Hope. Autumn's Hope. Gear Vendor. Rejuvenated Mask. Stamina Mod with Skill Power. Also, guys, uh, don't forget that I finally got a sponsor button. So if you enjoy what you see and you'd like to support me or the channel and get yourself some custom emojis, go ahead and smack that sponsor button. Where the hell is this vendor? Am I like, dumb? There he is. The Crypt Weapon Vendor. We have an MP7 with Determined, Capable, and Skilled. I actually would probably pick this up. Uh, pure Players. Nope. No purple uh, mod so far uh, for damage to elites. And King James. There's a Lightweight M4 and the Advanced Weapon Vendor. And I'm going to note this. Um, where are we again? We're in the Crypt. I'm gonna I'm gonna say this because this is pretty good. Determined, capable, skilled. Um, I like determined and capable on a, or I like determined and skilled on a weapon to get your um, supers back quicker. So I'm gonna write this down. MP7. Determined and skilled. And then we have iron sights with stability, crit chance, and crit damage. Yeah, it's pretty good for skill build, too. Not too shabby. Again, welcome, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Blueprint this week is a converted USC and a Super 90. What the hell just happened? Oh, whoops. Sitting here waiting for me to fast drive when I'm not even fast driving. Uh, yes, Malek, 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 Norman, whatever. Uh, yes, there's a lightweight M4 in the advanced weapon vendor. Firewall gear vendor. We have a recovered holster and we have performance mob first aid ally heal. Uh, you know what? If you're doing a healer build, this is actually pretty good. Still no damage to elites, everybody. I'm looking. I'm looking for those damage elites. Unfortunately, I'm not a huge fan of the MP7. 
you know, it takes him getting used to, but it's actually not that bad. I, I like the MP7. I was using it with my striker build. The Grindhouse Weapon Vendor. We have an M700 with Capable, Deadly, and uh, Elevated. And then we have an ACOG Scope with Accuracy, Crit Chance, and Crit Damage. Uh, Hayden, welcome to the stream and welcome to the channel. I uh, hope you enjoy it. Southpaw Gear Vendor. We have an absolute glove. And we have a performance mod with sports station healing speed. Here you go, little ass kicker. We are in Southpaw. And Southpaw has a There we go. Got yourself a nice reclaimer. Peace right there. Support station healing speed. The Ward Gear Vendor Operator Cunning Gloves. And we have a Firearms Mod Exotic Damage Resilience. Oh, we got some damage to elite mods. We are in the Ward. It's an electronics damage to elite. Yes, Southpaw, you have an electronics um, damage to elite one. And the, oh, my bad. The ward is the damage to elite mod, electronic damage to elite. Southpaw is the spore station one. Not doing too bad now, guys. I think we got some decent stuff this week. Obviously, the blueprints are a little bit of a Debbie Downer, but whatever. Last call. We have an M1A with Deadly, Destructive, and Balanced, and then we have a Grip with Accuracy, Reload Speed, and Stability. Delhart, greatly appreciated. But I am not the best. You guys are. All of you guys watching are the best. Because without you guys watching, I wouldn't have anything to stream. So, thank you. You are all awesome. Uh, Madison Stand. We have a specialized backpack. And a firearms mod with skill power. And that wraps it up for the open world. Let's get into the dark zone. Take a look at my. Fifth Ab. We got a Magnum expert and capable. We have a resourceful backpack. Uh, crit damage and bleed resistance. We have a performance mod with sports station range, compensator with stability, headshot, and accuracy. Uh, I'm going to each checkpoint and then the safe houses. Uh, West 31st, we have a G36, Meticulous, Adept, and Focused. We have an Accomplished Knee Pad. We have a Stamina Mile with Signature Ability Resource Gain. And we have a Grip with Accuracy, Stability, and Optimal Range. 
Evil Dead, what's going on, man? How are you? It's been a long time. I gotta hop on pub and we gotta play again. It's been a really long time. I haven't been playing PC as much. It's a shame. West 34th Street, we have an M60, Unforgiving, Vicious, and Brutal. We have a Nimble Holster. We have a Performance Mod with Turret Damage and a Grip with Reload Speed, Optimal Range, and Stability. Nice, Aaron. Good job. West 39th, L86 with Fierce, Ferocious, and Vicious, Nimble Holster, Performance Mod with Turret Health, and a Red Dot with Accuracy, Optimal Range, and Headshot Damage. Yo, yo, Jersey, what's going on, man? Welcome to the stream. It has been forever since I've seen you, man. West 42nd, we have an M870 with Trained, Adept, and Brutal. Uh, we have an Enduring Mask. We have a Performance Mod with Pulse, Crit, Chance, and a Mag with Reload Speed, Crit, Damage, and Crit, Chance. <laughs> Tiki singing along. West 46th, we have an M700 with Proficient, Talented, and Elevated. We have a Technical Resourceful Backpack, Electronics Mod with Health, and a Mag with Crit Chance, Crit Damage, and Mag Size. Well, if you ever hop on the Division jersey, you got my number. Make sure you shoot me a... Uh, Make sure that you shoot me a message and I'll make sure I get you in. Because a lot of a lot of my buddies have been playing Destiny and stuff like that, so it's really been only one or two of us playing. Uh, no. Little ass kicker, that's wrong. Electronics do matter in 1.8. Don't, don't listen to what anybody says about 1.8. So, before I keep going, let, before I keep going, let, let, let's get something in the air. Uh, 1.8 will be coming end of November, beginning of December, hopefully. Uh, and there's a lot of stuff going on. Rumors, this, that, the other thing. It's still in the PTS. Don't take anybody's word for what 1.8 is going to be. All you should be doing is saving your exotic caches, your weekly caches, save those up for the, what you know, when 1.8 does come out. Um, Um, but yeah, 1.8 is in the works and there's a lot that is not good about 1.8. The Rogue 2.0 is horrendous. The stamina, some people are just, you know, not really feeling it because everyone feels like everything's, they're nerfing all these weapons and then bumping up your stamina. So time to kill is kind of funky. Um, but, and then Nomad's kind of crazy because of the healing and people just, strafe around um but yeah i mean don't take anybody's word for 1.8 man um just basically play the game as it is now save up your exotic caches save up your weekly caches and just take it day by day wait to see what the patch notes are going to be when 1.8 will be coming out and once 1.8 is coming out then you start to kind of get your stuff together and put all your eggs in the basket um but you know you gotta remember people are playing all these builds the last pts that i played i made this d3 build that was awesome and then 1.7.1 comes out and d3 got nerfed to the ground and i'm like what the hell and i, I had to scrap my build the build video i made was completely useless because the build that i made got nerfed so then i had to make a whole new build video so what i'm saying is when people post build videos and all this crap about 1.8, don't even bother with it. Just, if you're playing the PTS, submit your complaints, submit your findings, submit your, um, you know, all, all your other nonsense to Ubisoft and Massive um, so that they can fix it before 1.8 comes out. If you don't have the PTS, just play the game as is 
and just save your exotic caches. Um, that's basically what I'm going to tell you. And I'm not going to be like the other division players who are like, oh, this is going to suck. 1.8 is going to suck. Because you know what? Everyone says that. The, the update comes out. And me and my squad, we still sit there and kick ass. So no matter what happens, I'm still going to play it. And I'm still going to try and make the best of it. So let's keep going, though. West 53rd Street. L86, meticulous, competent, and unforgiving. Uh, tactical accomplished knee pads. Performance mod with pulse crit hit damage. And a uh, loud vent break with crit damage, accuracy, and crit chance. Now, guys, you might think that I go fast through all this stuff. Um, but I'm reading it really fast. And if it's not worth it, I'm going to breeze right over it. I'm only going to tell you guys what's really, really worth it. Uh, East 64th Street, Stamina, All Resistance, and Performance with First Aid Alley Heal. Uh, some people said Predator hits hard, and some people said Predator... See, that's the thing. Some people say Predator hits hard, and then some people say Predator needs, needs a buff. So, <laughs> East 61st Street, we have a Heavy Mag with Crit Chance, Crit Damage, Rate of Fire. We have a Compensator with Stability, Optimal Range, and Headshot Damage. We have a grip with stability, optimal range, and reload speed. And we have 15 times scope with optimal range, accuracy, and headshot damage. East 58th, we have a refreshed mask. We have a forceful chest piece. We have a specialized backpack. We have uh, operator prosperous knee pads. We have a tactical steadfast holster. And we have absolute gloves. Sometimes game is changing. Yes. Every update, I change my build a little bit. Park app. 1911, Expert Meticulous, Converted SMG9, Self-Preserved, Determined, and Commanding. Uh, MK... Let me just look at this. Mm -hmm. MK16, Unforgiving, Swift, and Capable. Double Barrel with Trained, Unforgiving, and Commanding. Hunting M44 with Adept, Accurate, Prepared. And an M60 with Skilled, Prepared, and Destructive. Really hoping Alpha is going to be for weapon talents. Yeah, I mean, they can't really do much more for the weapon talents, man. East 53rd, AK-47, capable, competent, commanding, prosperous knee pads, smart cover duration mod, and a 15 times scope, headshot, stability, crit damage. That multi ult is actually pretty cool, I must admit. Must admit, pretty cool. East 46th Street, M700 Tactical, Vicious, Unforgiving, Elevated, Robust Chest Piece. Firearms Mod with Exotic Damage Resilience, and a Grip with crit Accuracy, Optimal Range, and Crit Damage. Jeez, could not get that out. Yeah, Alpha Bridge is going to be crazy. Uh, Dirty Sanchez, uh, Striker Build, you're both two days ago. I know the OG money guy you're chasing. Rui, thank you for the sub. Greatly appreciate it. Welcome to the channel. Welcome to the stream. Hope you enjoy it. Uh, what do you think of the Lightweight M4? I'm definitely going to buy that, Matt. Uh, definitely, definitely worth it. Um, kill it, guy, kill it. Okay. Yeah, I kill a lot of people. <laughs> East 42nd M60 Talented Self-Preserved and Brutal We have a Steadfast Holster We have an Electronics Mod with Skill Haste uh, And we have a Reflex Scope with Crit Chance Stability and uh, Crit Damage 
Man, no crit damage mods. Not crit damage, what an idiot. Uh, skill haste, duh. East 40th. SVD, dominant, talented, disciplined. Rapid chest piece. Stamina mod with exotic damage resilience. And a red dot with accuracy, headshot, stability. Don't forget everybody, I am on Twitch. Uh, so, if you have a Twitch, don't forget to go and check me out on Twitch. Got some cool stuff on there. East 34th Street, ACR, Sustained Intense Swift. Uh, Savage Gloves. Farms Ma with Crit Chance. And a Grip with Accuracy, Stability, and Reload Speed. Um, Aqua, welcome to the stream. Uh, we have a Lightweight M4. In the advanced weapon vendor, uh, we have some damage to elite mods in um, Southpaw. Nope. Uh, the ward is damage to elite mods, and Southpaw is support station healing speed mods. That's about it. East 31st, P416, determined, swift, self preserved. We have a vigorous chest piece, exotic damage resilience, health, and ammo capacity. And then we have a turret duration mod and a grip with crit damage, optimal range, and accuracy. And now let's go into the safe houses. 4% uh, healing speed. Yes. Yep. That is in Southpaw. So four station healing speed. Yep. Uh, Frazier. Welcome to the stream and welcome to the channel thank you for the sub greatly appreciate it uh welcome 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 it is awesome to have you yeah i already have them in my six in my reclaimer too but there are people who don't have them. But yeah, blueprints were trash. Everything else was pretty much trash. Twice. Twice I had to put, hit the button for my heal. This game. That level. Mm, there's no Lavoa. Oh. Um, there's my Lavoa. Uh, DZ2 safe house. We have a tenacious mask. We have a robust chest piece. We have a, an inventive backpack. We have prosperous knee pads. We have a nimble holster. And we have decisive gloves. Uh, the talents on the lightweight is deadly adept, and then the last slot is commanding or something stupid. But you can just roll that off. Oh. But yeah, deadly and adept on the lightweight M4 and the advanced weapon vendor in the base of operation. That's pretty good. I like it. I will be. I will be picking that up as soon as I get onto PS4 tonight. Thanks, Treasure. I appreciate your feedback. No, Scott, that is wrong. Six piece, the uh, Michael Phelps. Nope, that is wrong. The healing speed increases the amount of healing per second. So, for example, without my healing speed mods, I was at 23 uh, HP a second. But when I put the um, when I put the healing speed mods on it, I went to 28k health per second. Uh, Hayden, final measure is beautiful. 
Uh, for a crit damage build, you should roll intense. Uh, roll off intense for responsive. Oh, you're talking about the lightweight M4? Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Intense is in the last slot. Intense is on the last slot. So, Scott, I have a uh, Reclaimer build video I posted on my channel uh, with a six piece. So, I, I explain the numbers for the Support Station Healing Speed mods, and that's worth it. Um, not competent. So, Andre, competent is situational. You have to pop a skill in order to get that. Now, granted, you are popping a skill because you're proccing adept, but just in case you're in that in-between where you didn't pop a skill, responsive is always going to be there. Uh, Hayden, if you tune in to my live stream tonight, if you can... I will I will show you my final measure build on my PS4. I stream at 12:30 a.m. Eastern time. DZ3 safe house. We have a PX4 expert and adept. We have a vector with swift, adept, and accurate. SA58 with skilled, sustained, and capable. Double barrel, brutal, dominant, and accurate. MK20, Balanced, Vicious, Cool-Headed, and an L86 with Predatory, Adept, and Deadly. Uh, I'd, I'd personally, if I had on all my weapons, Adept, Deadly, and Responsive. And if I can't get Responsive, I'm competent. <clears throat> I need water. Oh no. <clears throat> uh, Richard, blueprints are Super 90 and converted USC. Mordred, what's going on, man? Welcome to the Twitch stream. Good to see you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Again, everyone in chat, don't forget I have a Twitch as well. Go ahead and follow me on there if you haven't already. Um, and if you don't have the Twitch app, I would definitely download it. Twitch is awesome. Twitch is really, 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 um, really good quality streams. So I, and I usually stream to both at the same time. Uh, Mordred, I'm just doing my build video. Or not build video, duh. Um, vendor restock. I'm not playing right now. Uh, DZ4 safe house. We have a farms mob of health. And a performance mod with blitz shield damage. <laughs> Dude. Uh, what are good DPS build talents? Uh, deadly, adept, and responsive. Yes, if you do exclamation Twitch, you will get a link to my Twitch. And guys, if you have any build questions or any kind of things like that, just take a look on my channel. There's a playlist for... <laughs> Winter Tiger. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Yeah, Michael Phelps. Good times, man. <clears throat> that is that is true. 
DZ5, safe house. Uh, mag with crit chance, crit damage, mag size. We have a flash harder, accuracy, crit chance, stability. We have a grip with real speed, crit damage, and accuracy, and a 15 time scope, optimal range accuracy, and crit damage. Yeah, I do know that. That's very true. Uh, here, let me. There you go. Yes. Fraser, I do play with Snake. Snake is a good buddy of mine. But yeah, guys, if you have any questions about builds, um, on my channel, under playlists, there's a division build video playlist. And I have every single build. I usually do every build on a patch. I do a, a video for it. The only build that I have not done and most likely won't do is Hunter's Faith. I don't like it at all. <laughs> oh, and Deadeye. You'll never, ever, 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 ever see me run a dead eye build. Ever. DZ6 safe house. Final measure mask. Dead eye chest piece. Alpha bridge backpack. Alpha bridge knee pad. Alpha bridge holster. And alpha bridge club. Damn, I think they're trying to hint something. Uh, how long can SMG damage on your arms? These Alpha Bridge gloves are okay if you need a pair. Can you boy stick? If it's not classified, <laughs> very true. Uh, can you boy stack a debt more than four times on console? Yes, yes, you can. Nice winter tiger. <clears throat> that is nice. Welcome everybody to the stream. If you're new, welcome, welcome. Hi ho, hi ho, off to DZ8 safe house we go. DZ8 safe house. We have a tenacious mask. We have a rapid chest piece. We have a resourceful backpack. We have a prosperous knee pads. We have gunslinger holster. Nimble. And absolute gloves. Yeah, right. Uh, I wish. Uh, we have a striker mask in the DZ8 safe house. We have a Predator Mark chest piece, striker backpack, Predator Mark knee pads, Deadeye holster, and we have Lone Star gloves. 
Why are you angry, Michael Phelps? Yeah, right. Call an Uber, safe house to safe house. That'd be awesome. Jeez. I wish you could fast travel as, like, or move as fast as fast traveling. Nice, Aqua. Uh, Manhunt, the blueprints are Super 90 and converted USC. There's a beautiful lightweight M4 in the advanced weapon vendor in the base of operations. Deadly, adept, and intense on it. Intense is in the last slot, so you can roll that off. Um, and then we have some damage to elite mods in the ward and a spore station healing speed and Southpaw. Alright, DZ9 safe house. We have a Reclaimer mask. We have a D3 chest piece. We have a Reclaimer backpack. Tactician knee pads. Banshee holster. And D3 gloves. How good is the healing speed, bud? Uh, healing speed's perfect. If you don't have one, pick it up. Uh, ready. Then we have an extended mag with mag size, crit damage, rate of fire. Ooh, that's nice. I like mods like these. Um, we have a suppressor with crit damage, or headshot damage, crit damage stability. We have a grip with reload speed, optimal range, and stability. And then we have a four times scope, accuracy, crit tant, and crit damage. Really, Michael Phelps? I haven't spoken to any of the true mods of Twisted for two and a half. Well, I'm a true mod, and you've spoken to me, so. All right, everybody. So, that wraps it up for the, the vendor division vendor restock. Yeah, Darren, that's true. I mean, unless you like, for that mag, that mag was pretty good. Uh, so it really depends. But, yeah, so if you guys have any questions, I'm going to leave it for a minute. Uh, I'm going to leave it for a minute. Go ahead and post any questions you have into the chat, and I will answer them. Um, go to Twitch chat. Oh, the mag right here, buddy. DZ9, extended mag, mag size, crit damage, rate of fire. Thank you, Winter Tiger. Appreciate it, man. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the channel. Uh, Pablo, thank you very much. I appreciate it. 
Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the channel. Hope you enjoy it. It's good to have you here. So, any questions you guys have about the, the division, vendor restock, anything like that, I will leave my stream going for another couple minutes. Notice me, Senpai. Any alias? Hopefully I said that right. Any alias? Welcome to the Twitch stream. Mordred, I'll see you later, buddy. And an M4. Yeah, lightweight M4 in the terminal, yep. Yo, DSD, it's Aqua on here and the consoles I play. I got you. I'll call you Naya. I'll call you E, maybe. Any questions? Any, any, any questions? Questions, 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 questions. Yep, exactly, Darren. Exactly. Yeah, I feel you, Michael Phelps. I feel you, man. Uh, Andre, sorry, man. Chat's getting a little funky. Um, yes, Manhunt. Love you. I got three slots rolled to firearms and two to the... What do I need to change about my hybrid build in 1.8? Um, so Andre, there really is no answer for what you should change in 1.8 because 1.8 is not here yet. Uh, when 1.8 does come out, I will tell you exactly what to change. Um, E, the, uh, the extended mag is right here in DZ9 safe house. DZ9 safe house. 121 mag, crit damage, rate of fire. Um... I run my, yeah, that's what I run for my hybrids, Andre, is, is four firearms, two electronics, and then I get my uh, stamina up to 300k. So, I mean, when 1.8 comes out, I'm going to try it out and see, you know, see what happens. But, again, 1.8 is not out, so by saying, hey, do this for 1.8, do that for 1.8, it, it's, not, it's not worth it because... I'll say something and all of a sudden 1.8 will come out and I just got to change everything. So when 1.8, uh, when 1.8 comes out, you can rest assured that I will repost every build video that I've done for 1.7, 1.71, and I will redo it. Um, You know, I, I will definitely redo every build video for 1.8. So don't worry. You know, if you're if you're nervous about builds getting ruined or things like that, I always post build videos for every build, every patch. So you guys can count on that. Why is there no way? Yeah, yeah, that that'd be awesome, Darren. For the people who missed it, play catch up and go go play a couple of days. So you don't miss out on those exotics, or the uh, classified, rather. The one thing I can say, Andre, you might have heard it before, but save your exotic caches and save your weekly uh, caches. Weekly and exotic caches, save those for 1.8. Any other questions, guys? Questions, questions, questions.
1.8 should be dropping uh, the end of November, beginning of December, but there's rumors that it's going to be pushed back towards Christmas time. Damn, isn't that crazy? Christmas time is right around the corner, guys. Zuxley, are you on the live servers? What do you mean? Oh, PTS? No, I'm not doing the PTS. I was just doing a vendor restock video. This is simply just my vendor restock video. My normal division stream PVPing will be tonight, 12.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Every Friday, I do an 8 o'clock vendor restock video, and then I do my normal... Uh, 12.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Should Proficiency cat. <laughs> That'd be awesome. Uh, no. Um, you don't need to save proficiency caches. They don't do anything for you. Just save exotic and weekly caches. Uh, anything good? Yeah, lightweight M4. It's a lightweight M4 in the advanced weapon vendor in the terminal. You have electronics, um, damage to elite mod, in uh, the uh, ward, and you have a vendor restart. Uh, you have a support station healing speed um, in the southpaw, and then you have a nice mags with mag size, crit damage, rate of fire here in DZ9 safe house. Why doesn't any player hold value in sidearms and handguns? Offworlder, that's because it's annoying to switch. DJ fam, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. Too bad you're catching it at the very end. <laughs> if you guys have any questions, go ahead. I'll leave the stream up for another minute or two. Ask the questions that you have regarding the division or the vendor restock. And then don't forget to check it out. Check me Check out my channel and the stream tonight 12:30 a.m. eastern time for some pvp action thank you very much dj fan appreciate it andre you are very welcome very welcome andre really appreciate you being here every every week it's good to see you Fendi, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. Uh, Fendi, what's going on, man? Uh, currently 2 a.m. here. Probably won't be on. So it is 9 o'clock. So about three and a half hours. Three and a half hours, E. And then I'll be on my normal stream. Dirt Nap, what's going on? Welcome to the stream. DJ Fam, you have a question for me? Go for it. Any other questions? Questions, questions, questions. Lone Star Classified is going to drop from bosses or caches. Um, your best bet is to farm bosses, do missions, farm bosses, go into the, uh, go into the uh, dark zone and kill the bosses there. Cody, um, the blueprints are Super 90 and uh, converted USC. Yes, Dirt Nap, unfortunately you missed the restock. But fortunately for you, uh, the stream stays up. And I do post a video shortly after with my ghost top picks. Uh, Van, how are you? 
Is it Van or Vaughn? Probably Vaughn. Vaughn. Hello from DSD Ghost. Super 90 Blueprint. Uh, Cody, I'm actually on my PC. I do the vendor restock videos from PC because the fast traveling is faster. Um, and then I do my normal PvP and gameplay on PS4. Any other questions, everybody? Nope. That is not a uh, <laughs> dirt nap. That is not a command. But... Yeah, Super 90 Blueprint. That's a Super 90 Blueprint in the base of operations. Any other questions, everybody? Questions, 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 or I'm going to cut the stream and do my video. I'm sorry, Dirt Nap. If you give it a little bit, Dirt Nap, I, I do post a video within another like half an hour of uh, of me stopping my stream with the, the top picks. So, Darren, the way that I can recommend it is just try and farm for it. Alex, what's going on, man? Uh, ooh, I'm Vaxa? Vaxa? Vi? I'm going to call you Vi. Uh, I don't have that command. Solo Hexo build. I do have a solo Hexo build. I just don't really solo often. Uh, so, real quick. Uh, Vi on Twitch and Dirtnap on YouTube. The exclamation... Vendor command. What would you like that to say? Because you're not the only, you know, you two are the ones who posted it. Um, what, what did you expect to be said when you did exclamation vendor? Because I, I can try and see if I can do that for next time. Cody, what's OP at the moment? Uh, nothing's really OP. I mean, the Hexo build is still top-notch. Top-notch. Questions, questions, questions. Any other questions? Uh, best place to get classified to drop? Bosses. DZ. Best place to get classified is most likely in the DZ. Okay. All right. So exclamation vendor, you would like me. Relubanmania? Hmm? J-Man, what's going on, man? Uh, farm boss in the DZ. Yeah, for the last year. All right, so exclamation vendor to have the good items and locations of them. Okay. I could do that. I can make that happen. Next vendor restock, I will have that. I will make sure that I update Nightbot to have my vendor. Ed Reyes, is there a good zone to farm? Um, yeah, man. If you look right here, so I'm going to sh oh, shoot. You know, for some reason this doesn't feel right, but I feel like there's other landmarks over here. I feel like there's a landmark here and here somewhere. But right over here, DZ8, this area, DZ7 and 8, you know, pretty much all right up here. You can go and just do a giant circle. But right up in this area is the best place to farm. Do I have a build video for the Hexo? Uh, I don't. Oh, yes, you are my friend. Do I have a build video for the Hexo?
Let me check. Hang on a second. Um. Uh, Lurry, there is no. There's no Lavella, but there is a beautiful lightweight M4 in the advanced weapon vendor. On the M4, it's deadly adept and intense in the last one. I'm just checking for that build video. Hang on, guys. Uh, but, yeah, roll off intense. So here's the build video to it's a 1.6 build for my high end hybrid, but um, I would change a couple things. I would get rid of the mask, Pharaoh's mask, and the holster, and I would use a classified holster and classified mask. Or a refresh mask. I, I'll make a build video for you guys. And I will use it tonight. So you guys can see the build. Yeah. Yes I agree Andre. No problem, Cody. Uh, Manhunt, I disagree. Vigorous, refreshed or classified, specialized backpack, short bow knee pads, classified holster, and uh, MC gloves. Any other questions? Oh, forgot that I was sitting here on my map. Michael Phelps, I did not do that, buddy. We're waiting for someone else to stream. I only stream it once. I don't have full control over his channel. I don't have access to his channel, so I can't change anything. Uh, Hayden, you can check out. Hang on a second, I got you. I didn't promote my own channel, by the way. Everyone else said I did a very good job streaming, and there are other people who are going to be streaming, so. It's not just me. Solomon was never supposed to be a thing. It was always for a team. In my opinion. Was, yes, I agree. Solo Manhunt never was really intended that way. Look out for random clown win at ADS. 
Sure. Uh, Andre, I am from Jersey. Yes. Always have faith in the vigorous. Love me some vigorous. Any other questions, guys? So, uh, Hayden, go to here. Sorry. So, striker knee pads, holster, gloves, tactician, authority mask, vigorous chest piece, and ninja bike. Uh, I wouldn't do anything to that, E. That's a good one. Do I even have a command for this? Nope. Have a good night, Andre. Uh, Hayden, you can go to my channel and click on playlist and then click division build videos. And I have a bunch of build videos for 1.7.1 .1 and 1.7 that are awesome. So take a look, take your pick. I think I have a final measure on there, but I will be using my final measure tonight and my hexo uh, tonight I'll be using those builds. Is there a build for a one-shot sniper? Yes. No, Isaac. No tactician mask. Yes, Hayden. I do play PS4. Um, is there a build for a one-shot sniper? Yes, there is a one-shot sniper using attack, advanced, and all that nonsense. But, then again, you're most likely very, 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 um, very squishy. But yeah, I've made, my high end was, is a two shot, two shot sniper. Anytime, Isaac. Yeah, my high-end build is a two-shot sniper. Uh, if I had tack advance, it'd be a one-shot. But I, I don't like that. That's not me. All right, any other questions, guys? I really want to get this video started. Uh, so if you have any other questions, go ahead and leave them in the chat. If not, I'm going to cut the stream and start my video so I can have it out for you guys within the next half hour. And again, guys, if you have any questions, hop on my Discord. Uh, hop on my Discord, and you can um, ask me any questions you have on there as well. Uh, I always have my phone on me, so I can always answer your division questions on my Discord. Uh, so if you have any questions, go ahead. Um, there's my PSN for you. Yeah, you can be a solo man, hunt. I enjoy it. Any other questions, 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 questions? But yeah, if you guys have questions, hop on my Discord. Send me some questions on there. I usually have my phone on me so I can answer them uh, for you there. And also, don't forget, I will be streaming tonight, 12.30 a.m. Eastern Time, uh, doing some PS4 PvP. Uh, you can come on there, do some build requests, things like that. Ben, uh, I will be doing a video right after um, I cut the stream with the, good, the goods for this week. Lightweight M4, Advanced Weapon Vendor, um, some Damage to Elite mods, uh, and uh, Sports Station Healing Speed, Beautiful Mag, DZ9, stuff like that. But, yeah. 
All right, everybody, I'm going to cut the stream because you guys are asking so many good questions and I keep wanting to answer them, but I need to get this video done. So don't forget, Discord, see my stream tonight. Ask me all the questions you want on there. Uh, thank you, everybody, for tuning in. You guys are awesome. Again, this would not be possible without you guys, so give yourselves a nice round of applause. You guys are awesome. Uh, thank you, everybody, who's watching the stream. Thank you, everybody, who watches the stream afterwards. You guys rock. Um, you guys rock. Have a good night, guys. Uh, I will hopefully see you guys on my stream. And don't forget to check out the short video that I post later on tonight. Uh, and if you haven't, drop a sub, like the video. Don't forget to check me out on Twitch. And if you guys want some cool custom emojis, smack that sponsor button. Um, but yeah, you guys rock. Thank you all for being so supportive. And have a great rest of your night.